Hi, I'm Dr. Andrea Hatcher from Olive Branch Park Veterinary Clinic, and today I'm going to talk about greyhounds. Our first retired racing greyhound was named Katsufast. We called her Fast. When we first moved into our new home, one of our neighbors came over to our backyard fence and introduced himself. He asked if our dog was a retired racing greyhound. I nodded and said, she's fast, not realizing he couldn't hear my capital F. He gave me an odd look and said, I'll bet she is. I'm pretty sure he thought I was none too swift, though. Greyhounds are the fastest of the dog breeds. They can run in bursts up to 45 miles per hour. The only land animal that is faster than a greyhound is a cheetah. Greyhounds are in the sighthound class of dog breeds. They may have a common ancestry with the Saluki breed of dogs, of dogs prized by the ancient Egyptians. Some other sighthound breeds are whippets. They look like little greyhounds. Italian greyhounds, they look like little whippets. Irish wolfhounds and Afghan hounds. I've always thought they looked a little like Fabio. The name sighthound refers, refers to the fact that these dogs hunt primarily by sight and speed rather than scent like other breeds. I was surprised to learn this having had two pet greyhounds separately run full bore into a black chain link yard fence. But these breeds are prized for their ability to see the movement of prey not necessarily their ability to see fences that aren't moving. Greyhounds and other sighthounds have a characteristic cheetah-like body that is built for speed. They have aerodynamic, narrow, long heads and bodies, long skinny legs, deep chests with large hearts and lungs, narrow waists, muscular hindquarters, and very little body fat. Greyhounds usually weigh between 60 and 100 pounds. Despite the name, greyhounds are rarely gray, but can be almost any other color. Ironically, gray-colored greyhounds have been selected against by breeders because of the myth that they are slower than other colored greyhounds. Greyhounds are bred for racing. In the United States, most greyhounds are identified by tattoos of numbers and letters on the inside of their ears and are registered with the National Greyhound Association. Greyhounds are trained to race around a circular track, chasing after a mechanical lure that looks like a rabbit. Racing greyhounds usually live in crates when they are not racing. Questions have been raised about the quality of life and medical care for these animals. Greyhound racing is banned in some states. The purpose of greyhound racing is to make money. Therefore, dogs that are slow, injured, or past their prime and are unprofitable are killed. Appalled by the deaths of 20,000 greyhounds a year, rescue groups were organized to find homes for as many retired racing greyhounds as possible. Two examples of these groups are USA Defenders of Greyhounds and Greyhound Pets of America. Most greyhounds are retired from racing between two to five years of age. They are sprinters, not marathon runners, so they don't need a lot of exercise. Usually a nice leash walk and a few laps around a fenced-in yard does the trick. Retired racing greyhounds are generally calm and quiet. Greyhound puppies are rarely available through rescue groups. They are more active and have personalities closer to Labrador Retriever puppies. Retired racing greyhounds come off the track crate trained but not house trained, but they typically learn this pretty quickly. A few greyhounds can't be trusted around cats or small, white, fluffy dogs. These look too much like the mechanical lures they are trained to chase. Any greyhound and a pet rabbit would not be a good combination. A greyhound should not be turned loose to run in a dog park. Greyhounds usually live 10 to 13 years. They may come from the tracks with tick-borne diseases such as Ehrlichia, they may also have fleas, intestinal parasites, and dental disease. They are more prone to the diseases of the large and giant breed dogs, such as bloat and bone cancer, but not hip dysplasia. Their low percentage of body fat means they react unusually to some medications and flea treatments. Don't use over-the-counter flea drops, shampoos, dips, or collars on greyhounds. Adopting an adult dog avoids the long house training and teething of puppyhood. Unfortunately, with other breed rescue groups or animal shelters, you run the risk of adopting a dog that was surrendered due to aggressive or destructive behavior. 
In the case of Greyhounds, they're only looking for homes because they are now too slow to be profitable.